Hi and welcome back to Short Source Classes and we are doing Mathematical Physics Physics is a rapid fire solution and this is part 2 of our video so let's get started. The value of the integral integral cz to the power 10 dz where c is the unit circle with the origin as center is given to be. So a uh, pretty straightforward application of Cauchy's theorem. So just write down by, oops, this is, I think this is a bit too light. So let me just take a darker color. So, okay. by Cauchy's theorem, we have that the integral C uh, f z dz is equal to zero if f z is basically continuous at all points in, inside C. Now we have basically this equation z to the power 10 dz and this is basically continuous everywhere everywhere inside C hence we have that so basically we have this okay so basically we have uh, z to the power 10 dz is equal to c and the answer is obviously a moving on we have if a function fz is equal to uxy plus ivxy of the complex variable so let me just break it down so fz is equal to uxy plus ivxy of the complex variable z equals to x plus y where x, y, u, and v are real is analytic uh, in a domain D of z, then which of these following are true? So again, we can write that, uh, okay. So we can write that if, if f z equals to u, x, y plus i, v, x, y, is analytic is analytic then is equal to u of x y plus uh, i v x y is analytic then uh, if if del del x u equals to del del v del del y v and del del y u is equal to minus del del x v so your correct answer should be b pretty straightforward okay so let's now move on to our next question consider a cylinder of height h and radius a Closed at both ends, so this is closed at both ends, centered at origin. Let uh, ix plus jy plus kz be the position vector and n a unit vector normal to the surface. The surface integral, integral r dot n over the closed surface of the cylinder is. Okay. So this uh, problem requires a small bit of uh, uh, some concept, just a, a bit of concept. So uh, let me uh, solve it for you and you'll follow. So for calculation, for calculation of surface integral, of surface integral, we need we need cylinder or rather we need we need a uh, surface normal surface normal uh, in unit vector on top surface on top surface of the cylinder And so we have the unit vector n is equals to 
k unit vector and r dot n sorry unit vector in cat is equal to r dot k cap and this is equal to z where r is basically x i cap plus y j cap plus z k cap uh, is given as a position vector so we have the double integral of the top surface r dot d s is equal to the double integral r dot n d s and this is basically n double integral d s is equal to pi h a squared so this is on top surface and now we do the same for the bottom surface so this will be n is equals to minus k cap and r dot n cap is equal to minus r dot n cap equals to minus z equals to zero. That is uh, because uh, this is because uh, for the bottom surface z is equal to zero. Thus we have. Thus we have, let me write this with a different take. Thus we have a double integral bottom surface, double integral bottom surface, and this is R dot D S equals to double integral r dot n cap t s equals to zero vector vector x i cap vector x i cap plus y j cap is normal to the current surface current surface of cylinder and therefore for this surface we will have n cap is equal to x i cap plus y j cap divided by root over x square plus y square this is equal to x i cap plus y j cap by a and uh, we have r dot n so r dot n cap is equal to x square plus y squared y a equals to a. Thus we have because this is equal to a square so one a cancel out and uh, we have a. Okay. Thus we have for covered surface thus double integral covered surface uh, r dot n cap d s equal to a double integral d s equals to a that is area of curved surface and this is equal to 2 pi a h dot a which is equal to 2 pi a squared h thus the value of therefore the value value of double integral closed r dot n cap t s is the whole surface is the whole surface of the cylinder then we have pi a squared h plus 2 pi a squared h equals to 3 by e squared h and this is your final required answer that is answer b all right so we'll keep this up till here and we'll be continuing in our next video so please stay tuned